Hey y'all, it's time for another huge Shein nail haul. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Raven and I'm a fashion stylist and content creator. But on my channel, I do fashion lookbooks, fashion hauls, press on nail reviews, and travel. Yes, I am doing another Shein nail haul because it seems like there's like a million and one press on nails at Shein. And I don't know if I'm determined to try them all, but we might get close. So in this nail haul, I actually picked up some short sets of nails because I've heard some comments, some things about why I don't do the short nails, okay? And since I will not be wearing them, I'm going to give them as a giveaway. To enter the giveaway, you need to comment down below, I want the nails. You also need to be subscribed to my channel, okay? And then I will contact you so you can get your nails. The giveaway is going to run about a week because I ain't got time to keep these nails and then I will ship them to you. We're going to keep it within the continental United States, okay? Because international shipping is the B-I-T-C-H. Per usual, I'll be sure to leave the links to all of these sets of nails in the description box below. With all that being said, let's get into this nail haul. We, of course, are going to start with the nails that I have on. So this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long coffin flower pattern fake nail in tote. These nails were a dollar. What in the world? Are you serious right now? I can't even deal. I cannot even deal. And of course I had a discount code. So I think I only paid like 93 cents for them. Yes. And these nails are given. Okay. There are three different patterns in this set of nails and I love them. I do wish that I was able to mix and match like these two a little bit better, but it is what it is. The way that my nail shapes are, I have a five and then a four here. And I think a lot of other people like their ring finger is smaller than their index finger. I don't know, but it's usually like a four and a five. So if I did have those nail numbers, then I could mix and match them. But I really like this. They do come matte. I did add a matte top coat to these. And these are really nice. The printing on these are amazing. Okay. Like they did that, honey. They did that. Who makes these nails? And these are from False Nail Professional. Okay. Because these are professional professional nails like these are good i really like the pattern on these these are long enough my nails are actually growing so i may have to give up the stilettos honey because my nails are getting kind of long underneath and these are perfect they cover them perfectly moving on next up this is what i ordered and this is what i got these are the 24 piece short square flower pattern fake nail and they were $2. These are really cute. See, again, I'm not for the short nails. Like these, you have to have the stubbiest little nails, and you might, okay, to wear these. Maybe they just go like, they don't really go past your finger. I feel like if you're going to have a nail on, it should go past your finger just, just a touch. Like it should go past your natural nail just a little bit. Um, and I don't feel like these will do that. These do seem like wide nail bed friendly, but my mom tried them, not like gluing them on because that would be disgusting, but just trying to size them and they didn't work for her. And I guess she has wider nail beds than I do. So they may not be that wide nail bed friendly, but they look pretty wide to me. I don't know. This is going to give you a French tip. It is going to have like a black French tip. The printing on the flowers is really nice. Um, I don't see any like fading on either end of the nail. So these are cute. Is this? And then they do have some that aren't a French tip. So they just have some plain ones, a white French tip, a black French tip, and then they have the ones with the flowers in it. I really like these beautiful nails. We love you over here. Okay. Hit your girl up. But they always come through with the beautiful nails. I think maybe like one or two times they have not, but they usually come through. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the Long Coffin Fake Nail Multicolor. They were $2.50. So you know I love a good abstract nail, honey. 
love them down. And I have a set similar to this, but it has more negative space and they're matte. Um, and they also come with the orange and the yellow, but I really like these. The color on the tips is very opaque, thank God. Um, the nail beds are a good natural color. There's really no issues. The orange is printed over the white. So they did do a white French tip and then print the orange over it. So you can see where the orange, especially at the like, is it the apex? I don't know. Where the curvature of the French tip is, how the orange overlays that because it, it doesn't like meet up perfectly, if that makes sense. So yeah, but these are good. Again, you're gonna need a top coat. Always gonna need a top coat, honey, with these. For $2.50, hey, it is what it is. The design isn't too different on all of the nails, but it's still super cute. I could have worn these today and been fine. I think these also would be cute in matte. So like if you had a matte top coat and put that on top of here, that would be cute. I might try to see a way if I can figure out how to just make the French tip part matte. Maybe that's that's the thing I can do. We'll see if I can even do that because half the time I don't even want to add just a regular top coat onto these, let alone having to finagle with making this uh, French tip one. So we'll see though. That might be a task that I take on. But these are cute. The printing is really good. Like I said, there's no like fading on either side. The white is very opaque. Um, these are good, beautiful nails. Y'all are that girl. Moving on. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long coffin fake nails and they were $4. A whole $4 over at the Shein. I spent on these nails, okay? These have rhinestones on them. The rhinestones are placed very nice, okay? Very nice on these nails. The design, beautiful nail. I should have even known. Like, I should just be like, it's from Beautiful Nail. They're amazing. Go buy them. These are good. Beautiful Nail, y'all are over here showing out yet again. These are really nice. I got to open these because I got to see how these rhinestones are placed. Because sometimes it's giving that, like, putty kind of glue. I don't know what kind of glue it is, but it's the glue that you could just literally, like, peel up. And we don't love that for them. We love the designs for them, but we don't, yeah, we don't love that kind of glue for them. Okay, this, it's like a tannish taupish color is gorgeous, especially with this like pink. The colorway of these nails are really nice. These could even be wedding nails. If you're getting married, I am not, but you could be. They seem to be stuck on here. So it doesn't seem like they use that glue from, some of the other places, beautiful nail be on it. They be on it. But these are gorgeous. There's a lot of details on these nails. So I'm not mad if they was $4 at the Shein. Now, somewhere else, they would be more. Like Amazon, these might be 11 whole dollars over at Amazon. If you get them from Betty Cora, they might be 15 I figure I want them to wear these nails because these feel like special occasion nails. But these are cute. Real cute. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece short coffin fake nail sets, okay? And they were $1.50. Okay. These are just from nails. They just called nails and that's what they called. You are gonna have to file the tips of these. These do have that little like knob on the end of the nails and they're pretty good. You're definitely gonna see the glue through these unless you do this with a um, that like poly gel, gel adhesive, the gel glue. You know what I'm talking about? If you don't use just regular glue, but you use the gel one that you got to cure, that one, you probably would not see because these are very transparent nails, honey. Okay, they're giving negative space quite well, but they are transparent, okay? These are going to be, I don't even know what shape this is. Is this a coffin? Is this a ballerina? Maybe this is a short ballerina because it kind of comes in a little bit, but then it has a square edge at the tip. All I wear is coffin and stiletto and almond. So I think these are a ballerina because it's not an almond. The yellow is kind of meh. 
Um, the lines are clean. Good job on that. But these yellow, I just don't know. So they're supposed to be multicolors in this. Yellow, blue, and then they have animal print kind of. Ooh, child. Now, I don't know what they did. But whenever you get a package like this, it's supposed to be some glue right here. So either somebody ordered these, took the glue out, and didn't return it with the glue, or nails, the people who make this, don't include glue with it, then just get the other thing. Don't get the glue insert one. Because now I feel gypped. Anyway, so there are some just plain ones of this like pinkish, nudish, clear color. Then you have the yellow border and then you have the blue border. Now, again, it's okay. Like the yellow border is okay. There are some areas where the like yellow, I think just the ink kind of built up. So it's a little bit darker in certain areas. If you're close, that's the only way you're going to see it. Okay. Cause I'm like on the nails. Um, but if you're not close, you probably won't see it. They're cute though. Again, I'm just not this size girl and I'm a glue girl. I don't do the gel glue. I tried it once and things still came off. So I don't do the gel glue anymore, but the regular glue, that's me. You're going to see all kind of imperfections underneath these nails. So these are a no for me or any type of nail like this is a no for me because they're just a little too transparent. If they were a little bit more opaque, like just a touch, I could do it because you could just kind of see the like outline versus like what is really going on under the nail. You could just see it a little bit. You can't see like fully what's happening. And with these nails, you can see fully what's happening underneath the application of that nail. So yeah, if anyone from nails is watching, Get a little different insert. Thanks. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the Long Coffin Butterfly Print Fake Nail Set. And they were $2. Why did I say butterflies? These is flowers. The name is deceiving. Okay. These are flowers. Let's see if there's any butterflies. These are pretty though. I really like these. I like the smoky effect of them. Um... I don't like nails this shape because they just fit a little too like wide and flat for me. Like I want them to have a little bit more curvature. I don't see no butterflies on these. Oh, there's the but. I didn't see the butterflies. Okay, in the. First of all, y'all about to be shamed. Y'all should be shamed of this beauty nail. I don't know because y'all trying to be like the beautiful man. But your beauty nail, beauty nail, y'all need some different packaging because the nails don't even fit in the inserts. What is y'all doing over at the beauty nail? Get it together. Now, if you had the insert without the little glue thing, you would have enough space for the nails. But these things is coming out because they don't fit in the little insert part. Y'all do better. Y'all do better. Okay. But there are butterflies on this, so you're going to get the butterflies, the flowers. These are cute. I really do like these. These almost remind me of like a Halloween nail. Or if I had like an all black outfit on, I would wear these nails. It gives me very like smoky, like I am the mistress of a haunted house or something. It's giving that for me, okay? But they are gorgeous, okay? So if you're not a mistress of a haunted house, you can also still wear these. They're just really pretty. Like, really pretty. The nude, it is transparent, but it's kind of smoky, so hopefully you won't see too much going on underneath. I think some of the smaller nails have the butterflies on it. Some of the larger nails have the flowers on it, and then they have nails that just have no butterfly or flower on it, and they just have the abstract lines with the smokiness. These, I like these. I wish their packaging was better. do like these a lot they're pretty okay so let's put this back on um beauty nail though just get the right packaging y'all because or at least i don't know if y'all just put it in the wrong thing but just get the right packaging because this is unavoidable 
Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long coffin fake nail in multicolor and they were $2.50. I do like these. Now, the nail beds, not so much. The nail beds are giving very light, very much, I don't know, because they're very opaque. They're just not for me. I don't like the nail beds. Not a fan. Not a fan. Beautiful nail. I'm disappointed. Okay? I'm disappointed. Anyways, the printing on the nail, though, is great. Okay? The French tip is great. I just don't like the nail bed part. But this is a nice little French tip. I also could have worn these today. Um, I could also mix and match these because the color of the outline is in the color of this nail. It's just that nail bed. Mm. I might try to do these matte because I feel like sometimes... The color of the nail bed looks better depending on if it's shiny or matte because some of them look better shiny some of them look better matte so i might try to do a matte top coat on these and see if that makes it look better hopefully it will but that's these i like them you will have to file the tips of them because there is some little nubs that i see on the ends but other than that it's just the tips on the ends and the nail bed not for me Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24, ooh, 27 piece, honey. These are the 27 piece glitter fake nail set and they were $2. 27. I hope y'all really gave me 27 nails up in here, okay? Because on this, it says 24. Someone's lying to me. Someone is lying to me. I don't know if it's the Shein or I don't know if it's the package. It's probably the Shein. It ain't 27 nails, it's 24 nails. Ian, you got me excited. Yes, I did want those 3X nails just in case. Okay. Anyways, the glitter is going to give what the glitter is going to give for $2 nails. Okay. It is opaque, like towards the ends. These are definitely going to need a top coat. So you're going to miss a lot of that texture. Once you put the top coat on one, um, I don't really see a bunch of glitter in the package itself, which is a great sign that this glitter isn't going to come off super easily because there are some other ones that are just bad, okay? So let's not get the color mixed up with beauty nail because these are just nails, perfect nail collection, okay? And they seem to do a good job. Let's see if the inside is giving what this is giving, but I do like these a lot. These seem like a very fun nail. These can be a birthday nail. Add a top coat though. I wouldn't do a matte. There is, I can see a little bit of glitter down here in this little corner, but it really is not much. Even in the tray part, like there's really not much glitter at all. And for the most part, it's the bigger flecks of glitter, which I do like the dimension of these. Okay, now putting these up to the light, it's not going to be very opaque getting towards the tips. When it wasn't like against the light, well, when it was against this background, it looks a lot more opaque, but it is going to be kind of translucent, which I think is fine. The color of these nails are nice. It's like kind of like a pinky color. These are transparent, okay? But I think you could put a top coat on this and this will be fine. It's really not that much glitter coming off. I'm very surprised. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long stiletto fake nail and they were $2. These are really cute. I'm not a huge fan of the nail bed color. It's kind of like the same color as these nail beds, but again, it's shiny versus matte. Sometimes it just doesn't hit the same, but false nail, sometimes you hit, sometimes you miss. This was a hitter. This was a hitter. The lines are clean y'all. Very, very clean. With the smaller sizes towards the tip of the nail, you don't get as much separation, which, you know, is kind of expected. But these are nice. The lines are really clean on this. There are some areas where, because there's like dots at the intersections of the line, there are some areas where that's a little off because um, it's supposed to be over the line. And I kind of wish they were a little bit darker because it is printing white on black. So it is a little bit more subtle. Again, these could be a good like Halloween nail. I don't know why I just like black nails on Halloween. Look at me, liking black nails on Halloween. How cliche is that? Anyways, 
these are cute. These are really cute. I like the design. I feel like they give it some dimension. Now, what really could have set these off, and you could do this at home if you want to, but where the white is, doing that with like tiny rhinestones. Y'all see the vision? Y'all see the vision? I'm not doing that. Because again, I don't have that much time and I don't feel like doing all that. But if you do it, I think it can set it off. Okay? Giving ideas for you. Set it off with some bling bling. But these are cute. The printing is really good on this. It doesn't fade or anything like the lines on the ends. Good job. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the Long Almond Fake Nail Set and they were $2. Okay, these are nice. I don't... Okay, so <laughs> I thought that the plain nail was supposed to be like just like your regular nail, but it's not. It's not supposed to be like just a plain nail. So it's not supposed to be just like your plain nail. Does that make sense? Because it's not the same color as the nail bed of the one with the negative space design. Okay, just, just follow me. It's a it's a long way for a short explanation. Anyways, the green nail and the other plain nail are just gonna be the color of the actual nail. It's gonna go all the way through. The design is nice. I do like the abstract design. It is going to be the same um, for each like size. I think they probably only have two variations of it. The overlapping on some of these could be better because they did the green. I think they did the white over the green. So in some areas, I don't know. They did one over the other one. So when you mix white and green, of course, it's going to make a lighter green color. So in some areas, there's just a little bit of a lighter green streak which i think is totally fine like it gives a little bit more dimension almost looks like a shadow and yeah these are cute these long enough for me these might be long enough for me probably not at my current nail length because they're kind of they're a little long they're not that long so i think this is going to start to curve before my nail like my real nail ends so that's not going to be cute. And I don't really feel like cutting my nails right now. So these may be later. Or I may add these in the giveaway. So that I ain't got to deal with them later. But these are cute. These are really cool. Okay, nails. Now, these are better than the animal print with the little outline. But y'all doing okay. You know what I'm saying? You're not my favorite nail manufacturer. But good job. Next step. This is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the short almond fake nail sets, 24 pieces of cool, okay? And they were $2. These again are just from nails. The French chip on this is not gonna be like just a straight line. It's gonna be kind of like a little ombre, a little smoky. So that's cool. That adds to the design. The white is not as opaque as I would like it to be, especially since they're layering it on such a dark green color. Just needs a touch darker. And the nails almost themselves, I think that's just the smokiness of the French tip because it almost seemed as though they were darker towards the tips and then got lighter or more opaque toward the tips and got more translucent towards the top of your nail bed. Cuticle, if you will. But these are cute. The lines are crisp. They're nice and clean. They have like three different designs, at least in this window part. So you can switch it up, mix it up. Um, but yeah, these are, y'all get a B for these. Good job. Moving on. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long coffin striped fake nail sacks, honey. And they were $2.50. So these are very much like the first pair, um, the orange with the white, but the French tip on these is going to be like an ombre with like a greenish or like tealish to a blue. I really like these. The white is nice on these. And I think these are also from nails. Okay, nails. But because this white is printed on a lighter color than those previous nails, it doesn't like, the color doesn't read through as much through the white as they did on the previous nails. These are nice. The lines are clean. They did make sure, at least from the ones that I can see, 
that none of the white is going to go up on the upper part of the nail bed. It all stays here on the French tip. Okay, now, again, not my favorite, but y'all y'all are doing it. Y'all stay at a B pretty consistently. It might be a B minus sometimes, but y'all stay at a good B. Good job. Um, but these are good. Now, I can't say nothing from my previous video. From this video, they have stayed in the B range, okay? Because I can't remember what nails I did in the past, but as far as these, right now, good B average. Good job. Thanks, nails. Moving on. Next up, this is what I ordered, and this is what I got. These are the short oval color block fake nail, and they were dollar fifty five. These are actually really nice. The overlapping is pretty good. It does start to get a little bit darker where the colors overlap. That's, you know, especially with these kinds of nails, it makes sense. Not all of the areas do that because I see on certain ones, it just seems like it kind of stops right before the color overlaps, which is good. But yeah, these are cute. Again, nails. Y'all say it'll be. The nail beds aren't super transparent, which I like. And yeah, these are cute. You will have to file the ends of them just to touch some of the areas. Oh, sorry, y'all. Some of the areas are just kind of flat, so they're not as rounded. So you may have to round those off just to touch. But these are pretty. And the design is going to be more on the side of the nail versus like the tip. But I like that. This is cute. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long coffee fake nails, okay? And they were $2.50. I feel like they all have the same name. Anyways, these are dreamy. I like these with the little like, like these are supposed to be kind of like star drawings. Like that's how like animations used to do stars and stuff with like a bling. Like they're supposed to represent that. And it just always reminds me of like dreaming. I don't know why. Anyways, these are cute. I really like this like purpley color. Mm, it's delicious. Love this purple color. It is so pretty. The purple is going to show a little bit through the white because it does overlap. Like I can see that they printed the white on top of the purple. They probably shouldn't have done that. They probably should have done the white first, then the purple because there are two different purples in there, honey. It's cute. But I think that they should have done the purple, then the white swivel, and that would have just set it off and made the lines even cleaner. But these are really cute. They have clouds on them. Like, these are cute. I really like these and cannot wait to wear them. These might be my next set, okay? These might be next week's set. But we shall see. These are cute, though. It's giving beautiful nail. Y'all did this. Because of the white overlay, I'm going to give y'all an A-. minus. The nail beds are not super opaque. Um, I can kind of see them through them like a little bit, but these are nice. I really like these a lot. A lot, a lot. Okay. These are cute, beautiful nail, beautiful nail. Y'all send these your way. And we appreciate you for that. Move on. Next up, this is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the 24 piece long stiletto leopard print fake nail and they were $4. Yo, I'm spending my coins on these nails, honey. <laughs> $4. Anyways, these are cute. These remind me of some nails that I got in my, I think, like my last Amazon haul, as far as like the beading along the nail bed. Oh, I think that was the nail file. And how it's placed. Some of these is a little wonky. Now, false nail. What are we doing? The print on these is nice because the leopard print is actually like all of the spots on the leopard are hard. But they don't like read Valentine's, which I like. We about to pull these out because y'all, some of these looking a little wonky. I don't like that for them. And I don't like that for us because these are cute. Now y'all know, Lord help us. Okay, so the chain design, little piece that comes across the nails, 
some of the rhinestones, like it just, it loops and then it loops again. They're like off. I don't know if they're supposed to be off. Like it doesn't line up like straight across. Some of them go like this. I don't like that. Keep it even. I am very much that person. Like I borderline have OCD. Like things need to be straight. I don't like things to be like uneven. Pet peeve of mine. Okay. I really had high hopes for these. I really, really wanted to wear these soon. And I just feel like all day I'm going to be trying to adjust these things or I'm not going to want to look at them at all whatsoever. But the two top nails here are like at an angle. This one, very much so. It is like a bigger angle than this one is. But these two bottom ones are more even and straight across. So beautiful nail. Not beautiful nail because they would not have done this. False nail, just a little bit better. And it doesn't do like a perfect swoop. It's a little wonky in some of the areas. Mainly these two are a little wonky. Like this one kind of dips up and then dips back. Mm, what are we doing? But that is what it is. These also might not even be my sizes. So it might not even matter. I may not even wear these ones. They probably are my sizes. I'm probably going to have to wear them. But the like curvature of these two nails is better than these two. So just know you might have some variation if you do want to buy these nails. There's going to be some variation in what's going on with the nails. Okay? That's what it is. Sad leg. We've gotten to the last pair of nails. This is what I ordered and this is what I got. These are the long coffin graphic nail honey and they were two dollars and fifty cents why these were two dollars and fifty cents i have no idea why were they two again beauty nail y'all need some bigger inserts because this again is doing that thing where the nails are just like sitting on top of the end of the thing and that's not cute and because they don't fit the nails are all over the place i even got an extra nail down here who child? Who packaged these, honey? I got a nail out the thing. These things are gross, honey. It's, it's a lot of static in here. Okay. So these are going to be a transparent nail. Come on, guys. Just act right for a little bit. Packaging is a little clumsy, so these nails are going everywhere. Anyways, so the nail design is quite nice. The opaqueness of the tips of the nails are really good. This, again, is going to be like that ballerina cut. And these are cute. I really like the abstractness of these nails. The nail bed is going to be more like translucent. And it's not going to be as translucent as that like other pair that was really translucent, but it is, it's not okay. I think if you did a like matte top coat on this, it would make it a little less translucent, which I might do if I wear these. Like, I really do like these, though, because these are a neutral nail with a tip, okay, because of the design. But the colors give neutral. The design give a twist, okay? A little pizzazz, if you will. So these are cute. I really like these. I don't know. Okay, this is $2.50. But I just, beauty, beauty nails. Your nails so far have gotten, who else will give you a beauty nail, okay? But this packaging not quite an F, but we're going to give you like a C minus on the packaging. Get, please get better packaging where my nails can actually fit in the things that the nails are supposed to sit in. This is for shorter nail packing. Okay. And y'all don't even have glue once again. So get rid of this because you don't need it. Then you have more space for the nails to sit. That's how that works. Anyways, these are cute. I definitely want to wear these. You really won't have to do too much filing. I don't see any tabs on here or any tips. There's like slight ones, but nothing as big as some other ones that I've seen. The colors are opaque. I really like this. There is some areas where the black overlaps. The black is not that transparent. So I take that back. It almost gives like that printed feel of some other nails that have been on this channel before, i.e. the Glamourade or the What's the name of that other place I just did? The Betty Cora. 
okay so that's what it's giving and you see it more on the like nail bed part than you do on the French tip part but I can see it now like when they face the light you don't really see it but when the light is behind it I can see it I don't know what that means so hopefully you're not gonna be showing nobody your nails with the light behind it just show them like this and they won't see all that and you'll be fine I like the color of the nail beds too because they're kind of brown girl friendly they're more of like on the taupey side so these are these are some cute nails beauty nail you just need to get this packaging together honey like asap so that is it that is the entire haul honey i cannot believe she is selling these nails for four dollars i'm just not used to it okay <laughs> i'm used to the one and the two dollar nails of the she in not four dollar nails but it's still not breaking the bank so they're good by me and again per usual the links to all of these sites will be in the description box below if you've made it this far you might as well join the tribe of baddies on a budget and hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you're the first to be notified every time i post a new video and you might as well follow me on ig and tiktok with all that being said watch this video that was picked specifically for you